Hello, I'm Gabriella Rusk. Welcome to your Citrus TV News Brief for Thursday, April 28th. Here are your top stories of the day. Syracuse University Mayfest and Block Party concerts are tomorrow. Lewis the Child and Vince Staples will be featured during the day concert at Block Party later in the day. The Chainsmokers will headline in the Dome with performances by Chance the Rapper and John Bellion. Syracuse is asking students to fill out surveys with their suggestions. Renovations to Archibald seating and campus classrooms are in discussion. Benches are proposed along University Place to maximize community spaces. Students can find the survey on the Syracuse University's website. Ted Cruz announces Carly Fiorina as his running mate as if he were to run. Win the Republican nomination, Cruz made the decision based on her history as the chief executive of Hewlett Packard. On Tuesday primaries, Cruz failed to get more than 25% of the vote in any state. The announcement comes ahead of the primary in Indiana. Vice President Joe Biden made an unannounced visit to Iraq today. This is his first visit since 2011. Biden plans to meet with political leaders to encourage Iraq's current fight with ISIS, as well as to thank U.S. military personnel for their service in Iraq. It's currently cloudy and 53 degrees outside. Tomorrow will be mostly sunny with highs in the 50s. Your full weather forecast is coming up on Citrus TV News live at 6. That's all for your Thursday news brief. Stay tuned for Citrus TV News Live at 6 with Jacob Reynolds and Topher Lane. For the last time, Thursday news brief, I'm Gabriella Rusk. Have a great night, Syracuse.